You got your Nordic track from iFit and you want it to look just like this, right? It took us over 30 minutes to get our vault to look just like the pictures. And now that we have, let me show you how to do it really easily so you can get yours set up in 10 minutes or less. My name is Kaylee Roberts at Connect the Watts and here we do guides as well as reviews and news updates on Nordic Track, iFit, and other connected fitness equipment. So if that's something that interests you, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell button so you don't miss out on any of our latest videos. The vault design is very compact and tight, so if you're off by just one notch when setting it up, you may have to redo the whole thing. Once you've received and assembled your vault and have unboxed all of your equipment, double check and make sure you have all the weights, bands, and hardware before you begin. The vault hardware comes with this I fit sign thing that you can probably get creative with and find a use for, but we just toss it to the side for now. Next are the two types of shelves that hold your equipment. One type has openings, so you can hang your dumbbells if you prefer, but these don't actually fit the included dumbbells properly, so we're not gonna be able to use these if we want everything to fit. Along with the hanging shelves are solid shelves, as well as four sets of left and right shelf holders. Now, the real key to setting up your Nordic Track Vault to optimize storage is finding exactly where to place the shelves. If anything is off by just one space, you're not gonna be able to fit everything properly because this thing is designed tight. To install our shelf holders, we're going to start by counting from the bottom up. First, count up to the fifth hole, then place a left and right shelf holder on each side. Next, count up to the 14th hole and place another set of shelf holders. After that, count up to the 24th hole and do the same thing. Finally, count up to the 32nd hole and place the last set of shelf holders on each side. Once you've gotten all of your shelf holders in place and have put the shelves in, it's time to load in your equipment. The bottom row is for the 30 pound dumbbells and 30 pound kettlebell. The next shelf up is for the 25 pound dumbbells and 20 pound kettlebell. The following shelf is for the 15 pound and 20 pound dumbbells. The shelf after that is for the five pound and 10 pound dumbbells. And finally, the top shelf holds the exercise mat and towel alongside hooks that hold your resistance and loop bands, as well as a cubby to hold your two yoga blocks. Putting most of the top shelf equipment away, like the mat and towel is pretty self-explanatory but it can be a bit tricky to hang the large resistance bands if you've never done it before. Since you don't want the bands to hang down too low, twist each one first to create an X and then fold them. Now, when you hang each one on the hooks, they'll fit properly. And that's all it takes to set up your Nordic Track Vault to ensure everything fits and it looks just like the pictures. If this video helped you, make sure to give it a like so other new Vault owners can see it and benefit as well. And if you haven't already checked out our review of the Vault or our comparison between the complete or standalone Vault, you can find them here. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time.